What's going on, everybody? Comic Books vs. The World here, and I just got something really, really cool in the mail earlier this week. Now, if you didn't already know, Domir Swiss is a watch company that's been making these limited edition DCEU Justice League themed watches in celebration of the release of the Snyder Cut version of the movie, and they recently decided to let me pick one from their Mutate collection and send it to me for unboxing and review and all that good stuff. Don't pay too much attention to the packaging, it's really not their fault that it looks a little beat up. Probably just got some of that classic TLC like you get in the mail sometimes or something like that, not a big deal. Either way, I'm really excited to get an in-person look at this watch, so let's get this sucker open and see what all we're working with. What's in the box? What's in the fucking box? Now right off the bat, I gotta say, this is a really cool box. Super thick, super sturdy, with a nice sleeve rounding out the look. Very classy box, you guys. You see, the thing about classy is it's a state of mind. Inside the box, we get a little card with some neat details about whichever watch you got. And there's a user manual with a bunch of information about properly using and maintaining your watch. Both of these are pretty cool, and I'll be saving these with my box. But anyways, under all that... There he is. Check that out. Holy shit, does that look cool. Now, like I said earlier, Domir Swiss does have a themed watch for each member of the Justice League. You can get one themed for Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, whoever you want. But if you've hung around this channel long enough, then you all know I had to get one based on The Flash. They had a couple different options, but I really like this red and black one with the slightly raised lightning bolt logo right there in the center and the gold trimming detail work around the actual face of the watch. Look at that, that is gorgeous. I know you can't tell through the camera, but this thing is surprisingly weighty. Like, it feels like a really high-quality watch. I mean, I guess I shouldn't be too surprised, because this watch not only comes with a high-quality, genuine red leather band, but it's also water-resistant up to 50 meters, over 160 feet for those of you keeping track at home. That's just deep, bro. That's deep. And it's highly scratch-resistant thanks to the sapphire crystal on the face of the watch. On the back of the watch, we can see a few more details, like how it's set in a stainless steel case, and the Justice League logo is stamped smack dab in the center here. Now in case you're wondering what all this is, this is an automatic watch, meaning it will be wound as you move around while wearing it, so it doesn't necessarily have to be wound up as much as a manual one, which is a really cool feature in my opinion. If you do decide to get one of these, I'd also recommend picking up a watch winder, mostly for display purposes, because why wouldn't you want to show off something that looks this good, but also to help keep the watch wound up properly when you're not wearing it. So yeah, I don't know if I've gushed about this thing enough, you guys, but this is a great watch. Seriously, major, major thanks to Damir Swiss for sending me this thing and letting me review it. And if you guys are in the market for a watch that's super classy, very high quality, and themed around Zack Snyder's take on some of the more popular DC superheroes right now, then definitely check out what all Damir Swiss is offering by clicking the link in the description down below. And even better, if you guys go ahead and pick up one of these things using that affiliate link, then you even get an extra year-long warranty added to your purchase. Which honestly isn't a bad idea when you get stuff delivered, all things considered. Oh, Zoidberg, at last you're becoming a crafty consumer! Hello? Hello? I'll take eight! But anyways guys, that's my take on this really, really cool Justice League watch from Damir Swiss. If you liked what all you saw me showing off in this video, or maybe you already got one of these bad boys and you want to mention a little something about it, then definitely let me know in the comments down below. Otherwise, I will see you all next time. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, then go ahead and click that like button, and if you're new, maybe consider clicking that subscribe button too. I've also got links to my Facebook, Twitter, Twitch, Instagram, and Patreon in the description. You should probably check those out too. And if you want to see more of my content, then you can click the link to my last video. It's right there in the middle of your screen. Alright, and I will see you all next time.